Good evening, everybody. I just wanted to say a couple things before I start. Um, I've been thinking a lot about memory lately. I've been thinking a lot about memories that I have that I don't remember. Um, my mother recently translated a memoir from my grandmother who passed away in the 90s. And there were so many stories inside of this memoir that I never knew about. And it was so meaningful to me to be able to carry these stories, some of them, but they're so incomplete also because there's one sentence in one of the little chapters. It's about my grandmother. She had her feet bound along with most of the women during that time. She was born in, I think, 1913. Um, but her father was a farmer and he would travel overseas and he traveled to places like Hong Kong and Macau and Japan and he realized that binding the feet of your daughter is not a good idea. So he unbound them when she was small. But she had her feet broken already. Um, and this, this image and this memory that I don't have that I read about, it stays with me. Because I remember my grandmother's feet. They were a little bit broken. And I, re I realized that even though I couldn't communicate with her really well, she spoke t Chinese and Taiwanese and my language skills aren't so good, I still know her, even though I don't know all of her memories. The, feet that her feet were, the fact that her feet were broken and they were bound and unbound, the fact that in my family there was a lot of exile and trauma, just from the time in China when the communists took over and there was a lot of escape and exile, and my parents moved to the States, I was born there. And then it brings me to think about also motherhood, because I think about my mother, she's getting on to 80 soon, and she wanted to translate this memoir. And I think about my mother, and I think about my grandmother, and I think about my family, and then I think about my son, I have a 19-year-old son. And I think about this place, now that I'm in, and I think about, well, a sanatorium is a place where you recover from a long-term illness. At least that's what I read in Wikipedia earlier. Um, but it's a, it's a place you go to, to kind of recover and to heal. And I think about my mother. I think about myself as a mother. And families are complicated. Not all mothers are great. I had a complicated relationship with my mother anyway. But in any case, the motherly embrace that's very healing, no? So I want to give you, as the last set of the festival, a motherly embrace.